Welcome to Obidos, home of the annual International Chocolate Festival. Each year, the narrow streets of this medieval town, less than an hour away from Lisbon, are transformed into scenes reminiscent of a fairy tale. Giant mice guard Swiss cheese-shaped chocolate boxes as lovers roam arm in arm along the alleyways. Chocolate sculptures depict the story of Portugal's greatest love story, that of Pedro and Inns, the theme for this year's festival. Orbidos is a romantic town and many people come here to be with their significant other. It was here that the great love story of Pedro and Innes took place. So this is to tie very strong brands, Orbidos chocolate, under the common denominator that is love, the perfect connection. The love story has inspired artists and poets throughout the centuries. And now chocolatiers have created statues to commemorate the lovers. But chocolate is not the easiest material to work with. We need to be careful with humidity. Water ruins chocolate in the same way as heat does. This is why we use air conditioning that helps to control the temperatures in the rooms. And the sculptures cannot bear variations in temperature, otherwise the pieces can be completely ruined. Elsewhere, children have the chance to combine two favorite foods, pizza and chocolate, complete with marshmallow and candy toppings. And the grown-ups enjoy an alcoholic tipple in a tiny chocolate cup. I've already tasted a kind of chocolate which had a ginger while inside. It is very good and we will taste more. And this visitor is happy to try anything so long as it is chocolate. Oh no, are you kidding me? No, it's not. It's not the first chocolate, but I didn't eat that. So I can't um, talk about this one, but it's great. It's chocolate, guys. The International Chocolate Festival of Obidos is celebrating its 13th edition and runs until May the 3rd. Mike Fox, CCTV.